Welcome to Random Acts. Thanks for staying up. We are dedicated to uncategorizable short films from around the world. I'm Zowie Ashton, but think of me more as the considerate late night cabbie to your inebriated raver. Now I'm gonna strap you in, I'm gonna give you little sips of water on our ride together through the darkest streets of short form comedy, music video, animation, drama, poetry, visual art, and oh yeah, some stuff marked, no idea. On tonight's route, the underground world of gangster dentistry, a nightmare taken from an artist's dream journal and a surreal Japanese animation about rabbits that makes Tony Soprano look like Bugs Bunny. If I say the word pussy, what comes to mind? Cats, right? <laughs> yeah, I thought cats too. For 26-year-old animator Renata Gazirovska, it's more anthropomorphic vagina.
find a man with his own teeth. That's just some of the dating advice given to me by various aunties to stop me being too picky over the years. <laughs> I think I'm going to show them this next short. Did you know that you could convert your dirty cash into a mouthful of golden diamonds? I didn't. In this short from Lal Lindgren, two men put their money where their mouth is, big time. Hey, Pops. What's up, man? There's some people here to see you. What do they want? 26 gold perms. 26? How do they want them? Iced out. Iced out? You told them how much it's going to be? Mm-hmm. All right, well, tell them I'll be out there in a minute. All right. All right. Arnie, what's up? How are you looking on that six pack? Get ready to take the print right now. All right, cool, cool. Let me know. What's up, fellas? What's good? Lando? Yes, sir. What's going on with it, boss man? What you trying to get? You know, I'm trying to get my mouth all slugged up real nice, looking like snow. And both of you guys trying to get something? My man's getting the whole grill, too. And you know how long that's going to take? Time in the option right now. I mean, I got the money. Is you ready to make it happen? Brown paper bag money, baby. I will make it happen then. You ready for a long night? Let's go. What's up, man? Yo, Pops. What's up? Nine just pulled up, said they want to talk to you. For what? I don't know, they wouldn't tell me. Wait, they just got here? Yeah, they just got here, said they want to talk to the boss, man. They want to talk to me? Yeah. They don't tell you what, about what? Nah. Oh, goddamn. Let me see what's up. All right. Yes, sir. I can help you guys. A partner and I are trying to establish a time frame for these gentlemen here. Specifically, February 15th. OK. I mean, they look for me, but I don't know. What did they do? Armed bank robbery in Broward. Like I said, I seen them. I did some work for them, but that's about it. Did any of that money make it up in here? I don't know what money made it here. They paid for the work. I just did the work, and they're gone. Have a good day, sir. Money. All that shit in your mouth? For what? You gotta look at it like this. It's an investment. These guys will sit in jail for the next 12 to 15 years, and they'll let those stones in their mouth increase in value. Then when they get out, they got enough capital to get back in the game. 
probably do the same shit they were doing before. You know those nights where you're out so late you don't know whether you're up late or out early? I think this music video from Canadian art rockers Braids captures that feeling pretty well. It's four in the morning, the sun's coming up, and a lonely animated figure is walking the streets. No, it's not me this time. But it's a metaphor, isn't it? For the intangible spirit of the city. Or maybe just that impending hangover. I like rabbits. I always wanted one as a kid. They're way cuter than the guinea pigs I had. Well, that was before I saw this film from Tokyo-based director Serena Nahei. I mean, she likes rabbits too, but it seems she sees them more as the suspicious henchmen of a surreal apocalypse. This film is less thumper, more thumped in the head.
Dream Journal is a rummage around artist John Rathman's subconscious. It's like a front row seat to one of those really potent nightmares, you know the type, when you fall asleep after a cheese sandwich in a late night Google self-diagnosis spiral. Just me? This short has scenes of a disturbing nature, which totally makes you want to see it even more.
I had a good time, but I'm ready to go home. Sweet dreams, guys. See you next time.